Cranes and heavy equipment have been perched on the Hoyoke Dam during this past week. We are assured that the work uh, caused no harm to the fish. Part of the Hoyoke Dam is made up of five inflatable rubber dams. Rubber dam number two sprung a leak. That leak caused a problem with the water levels above the dam, but boaters are happy it's all back to normal now. It took about a week total. We, basically, the rubber dam is like a, uh, a tire, a sidewall of a tire, so when you have a hole in it, you have to patch it, and patching involves a crane and other things to get people on the dam. Both the repairs and the cleanup have been completed.